So now we want to know what you have taken away from this program in terms of rainmaking and then also what's next for you on your journey. I think my biggest takeaway from this program was spending the time to be diligent about these efforts. I'm learning to not let my day get hijacked. And so I spend dedicated time um, every day updating my pipeline and following up on referrals and checking LinkedIn. Uh, that's really been my biggest takeaway is just dedicating the time to this effort. And as far as my next steps, my marketing plan I think was fairly aggressive for me. <laughs> so my next steps are to follow up on that. Um, and I've already got our marketing director on board to help me be accountable for that. So just following my marketing plan and being diligent about that as well. My big takeaway was that this helped me get organized and focused on doing this part of my work, specifically the prospect or pipeline report, just to get everything on one page and follow that and make sure I'm following up with everyone on a consistent basis. And also allocating the time. I can't do daily, but you know, at least at least I'm getting some time on a weekly basis where I'm, I'm looking at this. And that's part of what I need to do in the future is make sure that I'm allocating time to do this and and then following up on my pipeline report of making, making sure I'm keeping up to date with my contacts. My biggest takeaway was the scoping of the client. So I really enjoyed and got a lot out of the form to organize your thoughts about who you know, what departments they have, all the information about the client and the contacts that I need to move forward. Where before I think I was just winging it, like this is a great client and trying to figure out, well, what do I do? And I think that scoping document, like I presented that actually to some of the partners at my firm. And I think that they eventually might roll that out in our practice development meetings because it was so helpful. And that particular session, I think for me was really instrumental on organizing myself. And as I said, like learning about how to approach things. I really liked this session as well because for a long time I've wanted to write an article or do a seminar or something like that. The second best thing for me was the personal marketing plan because you know I've talked about stuff like that forever and never really organized it again to do it. Having to write in dates where you know I would have my topic and I like to comment if I write the article I can have our marketing person make it pretty. But sometimes I feel like I have to take all of it on and knowing just write the article and have someone help you and then post it on LinkedIn is relieving. I liked the fact that I had to make target dates for those type things that I just think I would enjoy. I'm hoping for the work that I do, I get other broadcasts of information and articles like that and I find them interesting and helpful. So hopefully that'll help market what I do. As far as like next steps is really sticking to the goals of the deadlines and being consistent and making the time, the organization of it and it's clearer and easier to tackle rather than just trying to figure it out was huge and also will be my next steps. So I have to say that it's kind of nice to hear that other people are having the same struggles as I'm having as far as the timing, you know, committing the time because you get so wrapped up in everything you do on a daily basis. So that's been huge for me throughout this program is making sure I had walked off a few hours every Friday that I focused that time to do this work. So I think I'm going to continue with that. I'm on a rhythm now, so we'll just keep that going. Also, I think, you know, Jennifer, you provided some good feedback on our proposals that we do. So I just recently submitted that I actually went back and took your suggestions and insights and was able to kind of revamp the proposal a little bit. So hopefully that will be a good outcome. So thank you again for that. Just meeting with my coach and, you know, she's so experienced and is so good at this. So I think just continuing to have those conversations and make sure that this is top of mind will continue to be helpful as well.